Um, and a businesswoman entrepreneur. So yeah, and a marketer, of course, mm -hmm. big one. <laughs> Apoko marketing, yeah. Nona. Yes. And you're actually huge on it, big on it. I was going through your Instagram account, I was like, oh, it's well branded. Yani, ni ni pigwa pass. You eye on your Instagram profile. <laughs> Thank Does, you so much. Uh, content creation influence. Um, uh, no, your marketing skills, do they influence the type of content that you create? Um, yeah, it does. Because mm -hmm. um, coming from a marketing perspective, I get to handle different clients differently. So not only like on the influencing part, I get to give them my energy of now a marketing consultant away from influencing or creating content. So it really helps me when I'm creating content, I can push a product at the same way and it can still come out as authentic as possible. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it really helps. Uh, other, do other people, what, when you want to interact and telling you, giving you feedback for the content, do you use, not for the marketing that you do, do you use that to perfect your skills and everything? Um, yeah, I mm. mean, every day it's perfecting your skill. When you maybe do a project today, you want to give the next project your best. So for me, it's always like learning from something. So if I do this project this time and it comes out like this, what can I do better in mm -hmm. the next project? Mm -hmm. So the fact that I, I always believe in like every day, it's like some small steps. Every day you grew kidogo, kidogo, kidogo. Mm -hmm. It's not like a, don't put like a lot of pressure. So when I put like the small, small milestones, every client gets to get a bit of me. So yeah, it becomes quite easy because one client you're like, I want to give my best. You give your best, your best. When something else comes in, you give it then your best bet better. Like yeah. that, yeah. Delisikia fununu, kuuza ukuanza juzi. You started marketing when you were young. Yeah. <laughs> um, wow, I started marketing quite early because before that I was doing activations. The mm -hmm. ones you now you're like in the supermarket. And then bef after that, I went and did a project in Nanyuki called the Realtors Expo, where I was leading like you now the marketing all the way from now doing um, activities on supermarkets or activations like, um, how do you call this? road shows yeah. all those mm -hmm. being branded with t-shirts so immediately i was done with the main job of like no eight to five marketing i was like why don't i incorporate the marketing inside this brand that i'm building because i mean it's still me mm -hmm. so as i'm giving people this on the content creation on the talent and everything i can still give them a taste of tracy the marketer mm -hmm. yeah actually uh, Nikuliza at a young, mm -hmm. uh, my, <laughs> my director, you ca can prepare some images. Okay. Because uh, <laughs> I don't know whether you're in primary school. Okay. Or in <laughs> high school. You talked about there's a business that you're doing. You paid your own, you helped your mom to pay your own school. Oh fees, my right? goodness. <laughs> so, <laughs> to say my young, wow. I wanted us to go back okay. and actually look at her when she was young. Oh my God. <laughs> Do you know for this trip, I really, I was, um, I really cried in your mamangwa nili piehi trip. It was a trip, I think, to Wilson Airport. Uh -huh. I've never seen an aeroplane. So I was like, oh my goodness, here it is. I was so little. This is class. Oh my. <laughs> Seven <laughs> or s is a six there. Wait. Seven, eight there. N now to end up uh, next, mm -hmm. uh, as he uh, prepares that. Okay. You know, you do, you actually saw in a car almost the same. Okay. <laughs> but did you ever thought when you were young like this, you'll turn out to be the Tracy that you are right now? Whoa. No, I would have slapped you like this. I'm like, <laughs> wake up, honey, wake up. But um, I feel God's will, I think, on us, it, it, it kind of aligns with time. And, and sometimes you don't see like things coming mm -hmm. because they <laughs> unfold. Oh my goodness. This sounds like a TBT. Is it on Thursday? <laughs> <laughs> Uh -huh. I'm so little, cheese. So uh, the alignment comes slowly and like as you grow, you're like, oh my goodness. So each and everything I was going through in life, it was just a journey. It was for me to be here. Like whatever is happening in your life is supposed to happen that way. Mm -hmm. There's really nothing wrong with you, whether you're having problems or not. It's just a journey. It's your journey and you need to like embrace it. So, I mean, I, when I was here, I would not like have seen this, but right now I'm here. I am really appreciating the journey. And we can see the growth. Really, really. <laughs> <laughs> we can actually see the growth. Yeah. Um, there are times when you have been emotional low and you don't shy about talking this. Yeah. Uh, where you talk about moments that you are low, um, 
either through your own personal pressure or outside personal pressure. How do you handle that? And you actually overcame that. How do you yeah. handle that? And how do you grow out of that state in life? Nice. Um, I, I feel like every day I strive to be like a better person. Every day when I wake up, I'm like, I just want to be better today for me, for my dreams, and for my goals. And so when I have that mentality, even if like things go quite heavy on me, I always have that courage of, I am having this episode, but it's just an episode. It's just a cloud. So I am going to be in it until it's over mm -hmm. and then come out more stronger. Because, mm -hmm. I mean, on those faces, that's where you get your strength. Those faces, that's where you know, hey, kumbu neza show up, kumbu ni courageous manze, kumbu kona confidence. Like, that thing comes from there. It comes from those hardships. The faces like you're like, oh my God, I just show up at work and this and this. I mean, it's like you're going to get depressed once in a while. Like mm -hmm. sometimes you're going to face different hardships, but you counter attacking them Bass, yes. in a very positive manner. Uh -huh. It works for you because mm -hmm. when it comes, you're not hiding. You're there. If life in a kupiga, you're there telling God, hey, man, I najua. But I'm gonna just let you do you, cause I mean you know me, <laughs> and you I mean all in data kwa dunia. So yeah, and and from that perspective, it becomes so not so easy, but it becomes easy to cope with the situations and the hardships of life, even in the industry, in my work. Mm -hmm. It becomes quite easy when you let that guard out. All right. Yeah. Um, our today's question we had asked on social media. Um, What's the moment that made you laugh recently? As in Ukapa, Sua Tukicheko. Okay. There is this content creator who goes around um anachukua selfie and ana ha give you what I was like, how do you Alikupata <laughs> Mahali? No, I was just looking at her and I'm like, okay, this is funny. How do you just go and then Unachukua Simu taking uh, selfies with everyone? I mean hey, like that's like you, you are on Okay, you are an actor, so yeah. now assume maybe your confidence in Ezra Kuingi at Uka Toka Town or Kanza Fanya or something like yeah. that. Yeah. Um, you do your content in Kikuyu. Yeah. Una nan Kikuyu is one I relate. Okay, Mina Juana relate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> do you think Uko tied into a specific audience and that's people who understand Kikuyu? Um, what I will say, I will answer it as no. Mm -hmm. Because um, I always say we all belong somewhere. And me being that I'm creating content in Kikuyu, it's me being proud of my culture and being proud of where I am because I belong somewhere. You belong. Everyone belongs. The DJ belongs. Everyone belongs somewhere. And so apart from you belonging, you have branches. You have different things that you can do. So there's Tracy the marketer. I don't talk to you in marketing in Kikuyu. Mm -mm. I'm going to give you a very nice marketing strategy. I'm going to give you a very nice content plan. I'm going to... That's not in Kikuyu. I mean, mm -hmm. it's not in Kikuyu. No, it's not. I'm going to go probably on a mentorship uh, thing. I'm not going to even talk in Kikuyu. I'm going to do the whole mentorship. And, and it goes smoothly. There is no Kikuyu there. I was talking to people. There is no like I'm talking to Kikuyu. So it's just embracing me, embracing my culture, embracing mm -hmm. my language, and being authentic and showing up as me daily. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Um. I don't know if you know this, but uh, your content pretty much leaks on Twitter. Oh. As much, <laughs> okay. as, much as people watch on uh, TikTok social? and uh -huh. Instagram and YouTube, mm -hmm. it also leaks on Twitter. And wow. on Twitter, you notice, it's mm -hmm. not you who has posted. Other people. It's other people who actually <laughs> get in your content and say, look at this girl. <laughs> look at this girl. <laughs> Have you thought of, you t you're on Twitter. Yeah, I am. Have you thought of utilizing it? And it's actually pain right now. Yeah. Uh, uh, um, I, I'm calling it X, so <laughs> it's X, X right? <laughs> so Thank you for the correction. Yeah, it's X. It's X now. So, uh. yeah, currently I'm active on X. I was not before, but right now I'm super active, mm -hmm. uh, trying to keep up with the space. So, yeah, we're looking forward to join the whole packages that they have given to mm. see where it takes us as content creators. Because, I mean, it looks like a very nice package. When you look at the features, you can even post longer videos on yeah. X. Mm -hmm. You can monetize with them. I mean, it's such a nice thing for us content creators. Mm -hmm. And I'm really looking forward to continue being on that space and broaden it even with my content. Yeah. <laughs> um, yes? I mean, yeah, quite. I mean, yeah. 
sometimes <laughs> i think it's <laughs> only one video ah no no really yeah. i think there was just a video a photo i posted and then um it, it was done like a very nice animal i love a green one and i had like a very I had like a blue romper. Mm -hmm. So it was like a very nice, uh, it was a funny meme because I laughed too. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Tracy, yeah. uh, because my director is telling me time is up, mm. um, you can tell us your social media handles where we can follow and uh, know about you more and also check out your content. That is your camera. Sure. Um, Tracy Waitera on all platforms. Uh, Facebook, Tracy Waitera. Instagram, X, Tracy Waitera. <laughs> At a Discord, Tracy Waitera. <laughs> to tend zote. So yeah, you can get my content from all those platforms or you can check out my website at uh, tracywaydera.com. Mm -hmm. And yeah, you can see everything about me, the marketing, um, different projects that I've done and others that are coming. Yeah. Thank you so much, Tracy, Asante for being here. We sana. appreciate you. You're always welcome. I hope the next time I talk after two years, tasema masai sinikuja nitembea ni kwa mlangu. Fungua gate. All right. Um, uh, DJ Vinsimba. Mbi mbi ulituambia utuna mix wapi leo? Yeah, so kesho ndio nda kuwa naivasha. Mm -hmm. Leo na pumzika kiasi. So naivasha up to Sunday. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Na watu wato wangu, big up, big up. Majina list ni kubwa na stai kuwa biased. So big up. <laughs> <laughs> sawa, sawa. Uh, DJ Rajiz atakuwa pale, amenambia atakuwa wapi? Quiver, Kernel. So follow at DJ, right? No, follow at Rajiz the DJ. Uh, also follow at Kalamival. My handle is at Masai KTA. And sadly, we have to say bye bye. But the show still goes on. Next week, we meet here same time, uh, same place. Uh, after this, there's still more music. So, we got you. <laughs>